My name is Anna Bing Funua and I currently work as a consultant for the Asia Development Bank, known as the ADB, um, as a safeguard specialist for um, the Tonga Fangauta Lagoon Bridge Project. So a typical day for me um, nowadays is um, because I'm a freelance um, consultant, I get to drop off my kids at home before and come in, before coming and getting ready for work. If I need to go to the office, I can. Otherwise, I can work from home. Um, I pick them up from school. I make dinner, and we have time for um, family activities before we go to sleep. So during this transition of um, jobs, it is a very flexible um, day, which I consider life is good. I chose um, moving into consultancy. I think I, I consider myself a risk taker where I want to try, uh, try new things, explore new, new opportunities. Um, I find building a, the first bridge on Tongatapu an exciting opportunity. Um, and so working um, through this project is something that I think is quite satisfying because it is a need by the nation. And if I am able to contribute with the experience that I have, um, I think it, it is something that um, is quite satisfying to me. Um, as a consultant as well, you can have um, multiple contracts and opportunities at the same time. So you become your own boss and so to some extent so it's very flexible if you have things to address you can take time to do that as long as you deliver on, on the outputs of your contract. Um, I'm married to Samuel Atatafu Fonua, originally from Niwadoktapu. He runs his own IT um, business known as Fonua IT and Associates. We have three children, um, Alice, Sikayana and AJ. Um, all our children are in high school now. In the past two years, um, while I was um, working in government, it was such a demanding job with a lot of travel commitments and official duties that um, most of the time they spent with um, Sam here at home. The roles that Sam has played as a father and has a husband, I cannot measure. And he has supported me together with my family and children every step of the way. Um, running a campaign is not easy. Having the political agenda to be addressed is not something that a typical family experiences every year or every day. Um, having a mother away from home because of the demand of the work is something that they have sacrificed. It is because of their support that I am able to achieve many things that even I myself haven't realized or didn't realize. Almost all the workplaces that I have worked in um, they have become, they are influential people in the organization and workplaces that I've worked in, whether they are program managers or policy managers or um, deputy CEOs, majority of them are women and they do contribute and add a lot of value um, to the agendas and the success of um, the organization. Well, first of all, with deciding what to do, to the young women of Tonga, um, it is important for you to know who you are, but more importantly, what you want to become. And what you, can, what you desire to become or what you dream of becoming um, can happen, and the opportunity is there for you. Um, there will be times when your family might not agree with you because the nature of the work or the career you want to pursue is not accustomed or is not normal to have women in that area. Um, of work. Follow your dreams. Uh, when you have the opportunity, pursue it because your contribution and your added value um, is and will be um, tremendous. The dreams that I have for the future of the women of Tonga, first for them to realize their potential and their role and duty as partners in development. Without women's involvement in development and becoming partners, it, we would not reach the full potential of development for our country and our nation. 
I think more importantly, what I dream of for the women of Tonga is for them to be safe and free uh, from violence, from debt, from poverty, and for discrimination. Um, husband and wife and men and women are responsible to producing this um, society of fairness and that women are not um, restricted from certain things that they are uh, that they desire to do um, the responsibility is for um, also men that they do their part in childbearing which is also taking the time to be the father to their sons and teach them to prepare them on how to handle the obstacles of life as much as the women fulfill their role as a mother. It is class, results and substance. Tongan women are women of class. They um, have integrity, they have um, beauty, but they also, they also have very high standards in our society. Um, in our families, and that is what a Tongan woman is. Um, and finally, Tongan women are women of substance, um, and this means that they are women of power, they are women of positive influence, and they are women of, of meaning. Um, if you are to embrace these things, you would realize that you are daughters of God, and you would know um, what your responsibilities are as we are God-fearing women. Um, we are able to break a lot of barriers and make good influence in the things that we do and the decisions that we make. Mm -hmm.